Hey YouTube, it's Keith, obviously, and as you can see, I look totally different, and of course, this is going to be another wig review. This wig review in particular is for DealsWigs.com. I was sent over another unit, um, and I'm going to give you guys some details and basically my thoughts on this unit thus far. Um, first and foremost, this unit was dyed by me. Yes, I know, I colored some hair. I'm going to get into that later on in this video about how I achieved this color and everything like that. But first and foremost, I'm going to get into customer service, shipping, and all that stuff. So in regards to customer service, customer service is good. Um, shipping, it does take a very long time for you to receive your unit. It took about a month for me to receive my unit. Um, and the units, they come in this white box, which just has like the Divas Wigs um, logo and, thing like, and things like that with all the information on how to contact them and their little logo and stuff. And then inside the box, it comes with a wig cap. And then it also comes with this travel size wig brush, which I'm really happy about. They was given bigger brushes, but I guess now they're giving travel size ones. So it comes with this brush. It also comes with the little card that just basically tells you the specs of your unit. And this unit in particular, um, was a 20 inch unit. It was originally a number two at the roots and went down to another a number 30. Um, but like I said, I did color this unit, and the style number is 1078. And another thing that comes in this box is a pamphlet, which basically just gives you information on the company, how to care for your units, and it features actually a picture of me, which I didn't know about, and they need to pay me for. No, <laughs> um, but yeah, this pamphlet just tells you basically how to care for your unit and all that good stuff. Okay, I noticed that the top of my head was cut off, so hopefully you guys can see my whole top of my head now. I know how annoying that is in a hair review head and a hair review to be cut off. So hopefully you guys can see it. Um, but like I was saying, another thing that comes with your order when you order from um, Divas Wig, which is something new that they're introducing, is that offering free gifts. And this time in particular, the free gift I got are these magic leverages, which are basically curl former dupes. And I will be doing a separate video, most likely using these on my natural hair, just for the fact that these things are really short. And I don't think they're, they'll, they will work on the units I have because they're very short. Um, and they're actually too short for my natural hair. Um, but I'm going to do a separate video on these and let you guys know the outcome of these and things. But this is something that comes when you order. You get a free gift, which is these magic leopard. But like I said, I did color this hair. Um, originally, I will insert a clip right now so you can see the unit when I first received it. And the unit to start off was um, a 20-inch Yaki number 2 and it went down to a number 30. So I'm going to insert the clip here so you can see the original color of the unit. I really didn't like the color of the hair. I felt that it was very brassy and just a weird tone of gold. It was just really ugly. And so I decided to color the hair and I wanted it to be red. I originally actually wanted it to be an auburn color, but um, yeah, I'll get into that later or next. But um, as I saw, the hair texture was yucky. But immediately after I washed the, washed the hair, the crimps that was in the hair went away and I want to a clip of the hair right now so you can see how it looks right after I washed it. texture of the hair changed dramatically. It was very yakky, very textured, very coarse, and right after I washed it, it all went away, and this hair is very much so silky right now, and I'm really not happy about that. The texture changed dramatically. Um, if I order a yakky unit, I expect the yakky to be, the unit to be yakky, even after I washed it. And after I washed this unit, it is still not yakky anymore. It's silky. Um, so that's something I do not like and that's something I want to let you guys know about. Um, but other than that, I think that's the only downfall I have on this unit. It took the color very well. I used um, two hair colors and I did actually record a video. Um, and I am going to upload that so you guys can see how I achieved this hair color. But I just used um, an Adore semi-permanent color in Intense Red and then a Jazzing semi-permanent color in Spice Cognac. And like I said, I was trying to achieve an auburn color, and um, the only reason I used this spice cognac because my sister gave it to me, so I didn't want to be wasteful, so I used it. But I think I should actually got a burgundy color and not a red. Um, but it looked burgundy sort of on the on the hair, but I don't know. Whatever. In the end, this hair turned out really, really bright, and I think I am going to color it a little bit darker. Tell me if you guys think the color looks good on me, or if you guys think I should go darker. I think I should go darker, and I think I am going to go darker. Um, just because I feel like this red is just too much for me. Um, so I used these two colors to achieve this 
look and like I said I will have a video uploaded so you guys can see how I did it um but the hair is not shedding I'm not experiencing any tangler or anything like that um besides the fact that the texture changing I like this unit overall I am going to curl it and I will show you guys in another video how it looks curled I think this hair probably look better curled I don't really like it too much um straight down like this but I just want to show you guys how it looks straightened um, again, this unit was from divaswigs.com. It is 20 inches, and I did color it to this red color. It originally was a number two roots, and it went down to a number 30 um, blonde color. And this is a true 20 inch. The density, it's very thin. Um, even for it to be straightened, it's very thin. I did go ahead and cut some layers into the unit, and I did tweeze apart a little bit. Not too much, um, but I did tweeze a little bit. So this is a part. So yeah, I did tweeze apart a bit, um, but not too much. I don't even really put too much concealer through it. Um, but overall, I do like this unit. It's just the texture change is a big no-no to me. And I am going to stem the to see the, the full length. And if you guys have any other questions, please feel free to leave them down below. Comments or anything like that, of course, leave them down below. Tell me what you guys definitely think of this red on me. If you prefer the blonde on me, if you prefer, prefer me to be in dark colors. Um, my boyfriend doesn't like this color. <laughs> um, but yeah. But he doesn't like this color on me. Um, but I think it's different. That's what I like about wigs. You're able to switch up colors and do things that you... I got a color on my hand. But do things that you normally wouldn't do and not damage your hair. That's why I absolutely love wearing wigs and weaves because I could do so much and experience was, experiment so much and not mess my hair up. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Please continue to subscribe, comment, rate, and thank you for watching. Bye, guys.